Do you hear all that beeping out there? Parked overnight at this Home Depot in Escondido. I really appreciate them letting me do that. But to be honest, between you and me, I wish I would have just parked at that off-ramp I saw 20 miles ago because that would have been probably a better chance of actually getting any sleep. And I'm not trying to be a complainer, but... She said, next time just park here and you'll be fine all night. And I didn't have the heart to tell her, lady, there will never be a next time. Because you just hear that sound all night long. Today's going to be fun. Can you see where that guy's four ways are on? Oh, he just turned his lights off. But where that other flatbed is parked is where I started the night last night. This is the theme for this video today. It's just gonna be me complaining about everything, much like every other video I've ever produced. Do you guys like how they overloaded the crap out of that roll-off container? So this lady already hates my guts because, like I was awake and everything, but when she knocked on my door, she was like trying to tell me exactly where she wanted me to go. And she was like, you need to get your cab over as close to the half fall as possible, but so that we can get to you from both sides. And I'm like, so you need me in the middle? She's like, no, you need to be over it. And I was like, okay. And so then I, <laughs> I maneuvered my truck to where I was right in the middle of this little alleyway. <laughs> and she was very exasperated. And then I said, can you just show me exactly where you want me? And then she didn't. She gave me more hand gestures and shoulder shrugs and everything. And then I pulled over here by this wall and then she's like, now you have to back up so we can get it to, from both sides. And then I was like, oh, so that my trailer part back there is okay. So she hates my guts. Somebody else will be here at seven. It's seven ten. Nobody's there. So she's a liar. That's too bad. I've given her my paperwork. And uh, should be getting unloaded soon. <laughs> that guy has been, <laughs> been ringing that bell and cranking on the door handle for like 10 minutes straight. Doesn't realize that all the forklifts are out here. I'm unloaded. I got my paperwork. I got my next load. And now we're going to go drive to LA and pick it up. Now the fun part of trying to get out of here. I don't know where I'm at. Somewhere on I-5 between San Diego and LA and it's poop time. That could be best described as an unpleasant experience. It's you guys hear that noise? That's coming from somewhere in my dash, I think. I don't know what it is. It's annoying. Classic reefer boy, just hogging up the lane, blocking everybody. I'm in Vernon, California, and I have found the culprit to the noise and possibly the air leak. I never use this thing. The noise is gone. I'm really good at this. If that solves my air leak, I'm gonna feel like the biggest dummy ever. How are my nose hairs? I gotta go check in. You guys wait here. 
don't fight. Just checked in and she said that I'm getting, I already forgot what she told me what I'm getting, but I need six dunnages. One dunnage, ah, ah, ah. So they're gonna ban TikTok, huh? It's too bad. The key is to remain cool when you drop one. Man, a Mexican food truck just showed up. I am hungry. What time is it? 11. The lady that's back there cooking in that thing, she is a machine. Oh, I got a gigantic burrito, by the way. Might put a damper on the 72 hour water fast. This is bigger than any of my newborn babies. Oh, boy, yo. Busting. Bay one. I guess I'm in bay one. We've moved up to bay four. I have a raging headache right now. Hopefully that helps. Oh, they're back. John ja Morant hit a game time three point shot with 2.7 seconds left. And then this guy, Devin Booker, just launched a full court shot at the buzzer and beat me 62 to 59. That sucked. I think they're almost done loading me. Checking my air gauges right now. Drive axles seem to be good. And so do the trailer axles. All right, there's no time for more games. I just gotta maneuver this truck out of the way, so I guess other guys can get by me. Oh man, what is this? Got us a flatbed in reverse into the warehouse. This is not good. We need to call somebody. I'll be right back. Hey, check it out, it's strapped. Some of you guys see me put V-boards up there to protect my tarps and then you're like, that's not how I do it. Hey, <clears throat> wake up. Our tarp job's done. <sighs> Feels pretty good. My favorite thing to tarp is uh, flat steel or steel tubing when it's not shredding my tarps up, but there you go. Please rate that tarp job. It's gotta be at least a 9.3. And how long did that take? I have no idea, but it's 10.50 p.m. Pretty sure I got here somewhere around, what did I say? It's 2.50 p.m., is that what I said? So I think I got here at 10.30, so. Between the taco truck and the getting loaded, we are finally done. I have baby wiped myself down. This is, um, Ted Nair, that's Sam's dad. Remember Sam from yesterday? And also my hard hat, which if I get any comments that are like, your hard hat's on backwards, shut up, dude. I have to say that every time I wear my hard hat now because, oh, combative? I think we're ready. Are we ready? Are you guys ready? I'm ready. I am not interested in Ruining my trailer. All right, let's let's try to get out of Los Angeles now. This tarp job is freaking banging, dude. Which way do I want to go? This way. Go ahead. Thank you for waving. Nobody on the northeast wants to wave anymore. Did I say on the northeast? In the northeast, there we go, we're back. What is happening?
<laughs> okay, I see that. Oh, <laughs> uh, he got one dollar. All that for one dollar? <laughs> uh, dude, there, there's nothing like LA. I'll tell you that right now. There's an SUV just driving in the river down there. Did you guys see that? as you'll ever see the grapevine. Three months from now, it'll all be on fire. Just kidding. Uh-oh, I think he got one of these trucks doing more than 35. I never did see that CHP pull anybody over. This is Lodi, California. And we're here to get fuel. How about those bugs? Somebody should do something about that. Three deep on the curb, baby. How do you like my windshield? It's a lot better now, isn't it? In your face. What's happening? Oh, we're back. I have 58 minutes left to drive. I would have loved to get lucky here been able to park but ain't no shot so we're gonna keep going I got another 58 minutes left of driving and I have a place picked out that I am 43% positive might have some space oh, I can't even make it there oh no I have an hour oh I have an hour and a half left to drive, 58 minutes left before my break, which is going to be up in five. Okay, I'm confusing myself. Nice. Turn left on North Thornton Road. Then I'm not sure how good this GoPro is, but whenever the Sacramento Kings win a home game, they light the beam. There's definitely a purple beam being lit off to the right there. I don't know if you can see it or not. Okay, this side is full. And that side does not look any better. We're not parking here tonight. Take the ramp ahead. Arbuckle, California. We're right where I belong. In the dirt on an off ramp. So that's pretty cool. 
I had a whopping three minutes left. Oh, what time is it? I'm glad you asked. 12.08 A to the M. Sorry, I had to turn the truck on because my steer tire was like on the pavement instead of in the dirt. And so I put it in the dirt with the rest of my tires. So now I'm a lot more flatter. I wish you guys could see how pretty the stars are. Can you see? Of course not because this GoPro is trash. Oh, now you can't even see me. There, there's my fat face. But anyways, given the fact that it is 12.08 a.m., I think I'm going to go to bed because remember this morning when I woke up and I got like not a lot of great sleep? Me too. So thanks for watching. If you're still here, love you guys. Orientation on Monday.